The loft tool creates complex shapes defined by cross-sectional profiles. For more control over the shape in between the profiles, you can create guide curves and use connection points. Visit our other tutorials to learn tips about creating guide curves. To use the loft tool, go to Tools and then select Loft. Select the loft profiles, such as faces or sketch profiles, in the order that they should be connected. Then, select and adjust the necessary loft connection points and guide curves. To finish, select Done. To view or refine history parameters for the loft tool, find a specific step for your loft action and open the expandable card. From there, you can update the profile, periodic loft, guide, start and end magnitude, and start and end continuity. To choose different loft profiles, click or tap the Edit or Select button beside Profiles. Select New Loft Profiles and then select Done to finish. To choose different guides, click or tap the Edit or Select button beside Guides. Select New Loft Guides and then select Done to finish. You can also modify the Start and End Continuity and Start and End Magnitude settings. To choose a different Start and End Continuity, select the drop-down box and then choose between None, G1, or G2. To define a Start and End Magnitude, enter the value in the corresponding fields. If your loft is curved or has periodicity, you can turn on periodic loft to blend or smoothen the first and last profile. 